I was asked to graph the equation x plus 2y equals 6. So here's how we could do that. We could use slope-intercept formula. We could rearrange the equation into this format here and use slope-intercept formula. But in this video, I'm going to use a table of values. If you need help with slope-intercept formula, there's a link at the end of this video. So let's choose values for x here. We'll get a value for y and that point, we can graph those to get the line for x plus 2y equals 6. I always like to start out with 0. So if x is 0, 2 just means that 2y equals 6, divide both by 2, y equals 6 over 2. That's 3. That's our first point. I can choose any value for x. I'll get a value for y, and that point will be on the, the line, x plus 2y equals 6. But I want it to fit on the graph paper and be kind of easy to work with. So I think what I'm going to do is say x is 2. So if x is 2, what I'll need to do, I have 2 plus 2y equals 6. Let's subtract 2 from both sides. And now I have 2y equals 6 minus 2 is 4. Let's divide these by 2. So y equals 4 over 2. That's 2. So we have our next point. And we could stop here, but it's good to have a third point in case we made an error. So let's just say 4 here. If x is 4, we have 4 plus 2y equals 6. Let's subtract 4 from both sides. That gives us 2y equals 2. Divide by 2. y equals 2 over 2. That's 1. So these are the points that we'll graph for the equation x plus 2y equals 6. So we go x is 0, y is 3. Here's x is 0, and we go y is 3. That's the y-intercept. And then we have 2 for x right here, and y is 2. And our last point, x is 4, y is 1. So 4, 1. And you can see we have a line there. Let's put a line through that. And then arrows to show that that goes to infinity. And that's the graph for x plus 2y equals 6. And again, you could choose any values for x. You get a y value that when you graphed it, it would be on our line here. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.